Hey, what's up guys, it's Pablo here. I'm gonna be showing you how to apply uh, Vscale Gray to your videos. Um, this is gonna be the easiest way possible to do this. There are multiple ways to grade videos in Lightroom. This is just the easiest, but then again, you are gonna limit yourself to um, a ton of options that you could be using in like um, DaVinci or something in After Effects or Premiere or whatever. So um, go ahead, um, you can go ahead and import, start a new catalog, Go ahead and import your videos as you would photos. Um, once you go ahead and do that, then uh, have your library open. Um, you're not gonna be able to open up videos and develop. So um, let me reset this if I can. Okay. So um, once you have your video here, um, under quick develop on the right, go down to save preset and then your Visco presets will um, open up and then just from there, just go ahead and find whichever one you want to use. Um, I'm going to go ahead with Visco Film 5 and Royal Gold. Let's try something different. <laughs> um, just a couple of pointers. You are going to need a pretty fast system um, just because the video lags. I guess just because Lightroom is not meant for video. Um, so... Here are your options. All you can really change is temperature, tint, exposure, contrast, your whites and blacks. You can't adjust your curves or anything, um, which is kind of sucks. And then you don't have your hue, saturation, and luminance. So um, just going to go ahead and mess around with this a little bit. And that will do it for me. I'll just leave it at here. And once you have your final product or whatever, you can highlight all your videos at the same time or just select one, go ahead, export, um, choose wherever you want to put it and then, um, name it, whatever. And then under file naming, you're going to see video, video format, put it at H.264 and then quality, uh, leave it at max and, uh, source and target source is what, um, what frame rate and quality uh, came out of the camera when you record it and your target is um, what it's going to export at. So once you have that, go ahead and export and then um, just wait for that to export. And that's, that's really it. Um, that's the easiest way. But then again, you are limited to options. Excuse me. <laughs> you are limited to options. That's the only downside of it. Um, I don't, I didn't use any, I don't use Visco to grade my videos. It just takes way too long uh, to export and to work. And it's just not enough stuff for me. But if you learned something and enjoyed this tutorial, um, please uh, comment, rate, and subscribe. And uh, my main channel is in the description box down below. And until next time, guys, take care.